Hi everyone, we're coming in live from Token 2049 Dubai and we have with us a really interesting guest. We have Raj Brambhat, uh, the founder of Zebu, and they're doing quite a bit of amazing stuff at Zebu. We'll talk about all of that, but first, how's it going? This conference is pretty mad, crazy stuff happening all around. How have you been? Look, I mean, it was a crazy week in Absolutely. itself. Absolutely. Uh, Token 2049 decided to come to Dubai uh, and the most unlikely anomalies occurred. <laughs> right. We, <laughs> we saw flood, we saw storm, you know, we saw a lot of rain, and uh, that's an unlikely anomaly because, you know, it's Dubai, we're in the middle of the desert. But, you know, with the, all of the prosecution and difficult times crypto and web three communities have seen as a whole, that didn't stop us. Absolutely. As you've seen at Token 2049, it's extremely lively, we're doing absolutely amazing here, and it's probably one of the most productive events I've been to uh, since Zebu started. So I'm doing amazing, uh, simply because it's been extremely productive, and uh, as you saw, Zebu is one of the largest sponsors here. Absolutely. So yeah. the activations, the collaboration with the community so far has been incredible. Lovely. And uh, what have you been up to at Zebu? There was a recent 25 million uh, funding round that happened. So uh, that, that was a, that was our first one, right? Oh. Um, so I, it actually ended up becoming 33 million in total. Um, and uh, right now we're in the process of, after doing a successful POC, you know, we onboarded 95 institutions. We've done $1.5 billion in transactions so far. A little small, not that big yet. Uh, it's been eight months. What we are doing now, well, after doing a successful POC, is coming out with our own liquidity protocol. Yeah. Uh, the liquidity protocol is going to help us scale to actually finish $14 billion in transactions this year. As you know, our community comes together, provisions liquidity, strengthens the ecosystem as a whole. Yeah. Uh, that's our overall roadmap for the rest of the year. And uh, over time, we're going to be launching more and more services on Zebu. Absolutely. Could you talk a little bit about Zebu protocol? What's the, what's the idea behind it? Uh, what Where do you see this in the next couple of quarters? And Yeah, uh, absolutely. Look, I mean, like I said, our phase one, we didn't talk, do much marketing. We didn't have that much web three integration. Our main goal at Zebu was to take inefficiencies created by Web2 and TradFi and solve them with Web3 and DeFi, right? And uh, that's what our entire phase one of this POC were based around. So what we've done is, like I said, onboarded the institutions, done the POC, it's working now. So with the liquidity protocol, we're integrating deeper within Web3. Uh -huh. um, our next couple months are going to, our, our next 18 months to be exact, uh, we're targeting a $3 billion P uh, TVL. We're coming out with multiple products, everything from uh, institutions to retail can actually participate in. And uh, we're really building out the consumptive utility uh, for yeah. the CPU network, CPU protocol, and then CPU token itself. Yeah. Lastly, how does Zebu place itself against competitors? What are the com competitions, top competitors in this space? And what is Zebu doing differently to sort of place itself ahead of all of those? Well, I mean, in a way, you can say Ripple could be a competitor. Yeah. You can say PayPal is a competitor. Yeah. But <clears throat> I don't like to look at fellow industry partners as competitors. Uh, PayPal came out with a BYUSC. Uh, Ripple is making integrations with banks. Yeah. <laughs> In our case, we're connecting telecom companies, right? And there's no competitor in that case. None that matters. So we've created a decentralized layer for telecom companies to connect with each other, transact amongst each other, and uh, no one but Zebu is doing that today, and I don't think anyone but Zebu will be able to do that in the future. All the way best to you and yeah. Zebu for all of the amazing plans that you have, and thank you so much for joining us at the Coin Republic once again, and we'd love to have you again for a detailed interview, but yeah. this is it for today. Thank you so much. Yeah. Thank you for having me.